that that girl? Which girl? Oh, this girl here. But you're so beautiful. Talk to the camera. Tell, tell them how wonderful the pictures are. Oh. And Janet. Oh my God, Janet had everything to say about color. She truly is brought to the, the laboratory about how to present the images of Bert in different ways. I think it's spectacular, don't you? First of all, what's your name? My name is Lisa Lynette. And you're both stunning. Now, who's the oldest? I'm the oldest. By how many oldest minutes? <laughs> Actually, I'm 30 minutes older. Oh, wow, full 30 minutes. <laughs> yes, my sister sat on my head, and then my mother passed out, and then I, and then later she was born. But oh, to make God. a long story short, we're here. <laughs> well, that explains for our height, right? <laughs> Well, let's get down to the nitty gritty, right? Yeah. Okay, we've known Bert for a long time. Not a long time. Short time. How did you meet him? Uh, um, we, as, oh, at a gallery show. He was uh, presenting a model of his at a calendar, and we happened to be there, and we threw ourselves at him <laughs> to take us, <laughs> photograph us. We had no idea what he had photographed before, but... So you had no idea of the Marilyns and all the stars? We, we, heard, no, we heard a little bit about him, but we're, when someone mentioned us, this is about um, 12 years ago, Bert Stern, and it's not the same as Bert Stern today, you know? That's, when you, when you first got a, a down, glimpse you know, of these things, what did you think? Well, I mean, first of all, what do you think of Marilyn? Oh, my God, I can't believe she's such a great model. <laughs> yeah. That's for sure. And then, yeah, we were kind of stunned. I was like, wow, he shot those pictures? And, and, and his women name. love to shoot with them. They're now, really wh free with that? him. Why? I don't know. They're just very comfortable with him, and they just kind of give it their all. I mean, I mean, can you imagine somebody from... They don't feel inhibited by him. She shot with him in 1962, and she's pulling that bead like that right now, and drinking that champagne, and showing those breasts. I mean, back then, I mean, it was it was unforgivable. I mean, no, no, she was one of, she was the first to uh, elicit that type yeah, the of hit book. Vogue magazine. Right, right, and Playboy. Yeah. She was cover one of Playboy Centerfold. Yes, yeah, she right? was. And she. Uh, but, but a real model. I mean, if you look at if you look at the 2,500 photographs that he had taken of her, they are so unbelievable. You really realize that she is a model. Mm -hmm. You now, know, what, made you guys, what made you guys get into modeling? Well, we've been in modeling before we met first. Mm -hmm. And uh, Lynette forgot to mention to you. Oh, we're tall. <laughs> when he was doing a calendar uh, gallery show with a, um, Lynette show, gave him our little card and said, we have great bodies too. <laughs> and then we started shooting with him and we've been shooting with him for a very long time. Now, where are you girls from? Indiana. Indiana. Yeah, and we live in New York City now, and uh, we've known Bert for probably, I don't want to give years, but I said, yeah, about 10 time. years. Yeah. It's wonderful. And yeah. that, it's a great thing. He's it's a great a, friend of ours. He's a really great friend of ours, and we love him dearly. Because he doesn't like people much. Yeah. He doesn't like men at all. <laughs> no, I could see. It was rough uh, for me to interview him. Oh, yeah. Yeah. He's, he's, a, he's a woman man. <laughs> A man for the woman. <laughs> Doesn't say much about me. But yeah, exactly. Gonna... Yeah. You got it. You got to write him another yeah. time. <laughs> <laughs> and why is that? Uh, ha photographing guys. What, does he have many? He has. He has. He, he's, he has shot Vogue magazine for for men. And he has. Oh, yes. He shot a lot of ads for uh, uh, male uh, proteges, like you know, for his ads for smearing off. Uh -huh. Which are very famous sure, men. Sure. Um, which but I'm but sure his key is with women, right? Yes, he gets along with them very well. Yeah. Very good. Very well. Well, well I tell you, two girls are in a very enviable position, and and, uh, and it's wonderful to be with Bert. And Bert I've never heard is lucky. I, I never heard that before. That was really nice. <laughs> and uh, Bert is lucky to have the two of you. You're beautiful huh. girls. It's Thank amazing. You. We love him. And. Uh, well, you, you're, you're a delight. Maybe uh, in a couple of years from now, we'll see your pictures up here. And uh... They have been here before, <laughs> actually. But, 
Well, he makes exhibitions, you know, here all the time of his photographs of his well, women. Thanks for your time. I know, I know you girls have a lot to do here. There's a big crowd, and you know, well, I you want you to enjoy it. And uh, thanks for being on our air. We really yeah, we appreciate it. Yeah. And we love him too. And thanks for keeping Bert Bert. We certainly have an eye for women. I tell you, beautiful. You say that again, huh? Anyway, what, was, thanks. what was it like? Uh, oh, you're not going to ask me what it was like. Go on. Well, you know, it's the only question people ask. Well, I think they're very Great. curious. It was wonderful. And the thing that comes across is the relationship is unbelievable. She trusted you implicitly in that, you know, it's, it's amazing. And so many years later, she would have been 80. And Happy birthday. Happy birthday. But her, you froze her in time and, and in perpetuity. And it's always going to be that way. And it's, it's, we thank you for that. That really is. Thank uh, you for coming to the show. It's a wonderful thing. And we're honored that you're here, sir. Right. Thanks thank again. You very Thanks much. for your time. I right. deeply thank appreciate you. it.